Hello there. Um. Reaction time. So. Today we are watching Pragmagic. And he is showing some starter Pokemon of different USA states. I think. Anyway, first of all, we have Ohio. Start a Pokemon. Yeah. Oh god, I'm terrible at this. What if Ohio had starter Pokemon? Here's our grass starter, a popper, the kernel Pokemon. Cute. A popper evolves into Nimes, the cheery Pokemon. Nimes evolves into. Cabanted, the Fatal Pokemon. Now here's Very our fancy. Fire Starter. Fyrog, the Frog Pokemon. I like that. Fyrog evolves into Riburst, the Brave Pokemon. <laughs> Riburst evolves into Cryptoad, the Hero Pokemon. Very Finally, here's our Water Starter. Looking. Chew it, the Chewing Pokemon. Chew it evolves into Ratskull, the Rebel Pokemon. Ratskull evolves like into Maestrat, the Nemesis I like Pokemon. It. Like and subscribe. I out of all of those, I would probably go to... I would probably choose the grass starter, to be honest. Okay, now we have what if Alaska had starter Pokemon. Alaska had starter Pokemon. Here is our grass starter. Moose Room, Cute. the Moose Cat like Pokemon. It a lot. Moose Room evolves into Huntler, the scouting Pokemon. <clears throat> Huntler evolves nice. into how, Moose how does, Dog, the Ranger Pokemon. How did it see? Its eyes were like... Covered. Moose stock. That's cool. Now I here's like that our one. fire starter. Cubburn, <gasps> the cub Cubburn. Pokemon. So cute. Cubburn evolves into Grizzle, the Grizzle. gluttonous Pokemon. Grizzle like evolves that. into Charbarian, the barbaric Pokemon. It's Finally, barbarian here is our water be. starter. Flubble, the cute. bubbling Pokemon. Flubble evolves Very into cute. Delphome, the foamy Pokemon. It. Delphome evolves into Aurorca. I want the Oracle it now. Pokemon. Like that's that's my favorite out of them all. That. Okay. Now we have what if Maine had starter Pokemon? Had starter Pokemon. Let's see. Here is our grass starter. Barox. The berry Once again, Pokemon. How does it see? Barox evolves into <laughs> Shrubabe, the scout Pokemon. Cool. Shrubabe evolves looks into like Mountain, the folk hero Pokemon. He looks like a great guy. Now here is our fire starter. Shwimp. Shwimp. The wimpy Pokemon. Wimp evolves into Cute. Napron, the juggler Pokemon. Napron like evolves it. into Free Claw, the bizarre that Pokemon. That is, that is cool. This gives me thoughts of like a wrestler for some reason. I don't know. Finally, here is our water starter. <clears throat> Very Damper, cute. The Aqua I love Cat it. Pokemon. Damper evolves into Prowler, the Aqua Cat Pokemon. Ooh. Prowler evolves into. Basilinx, the crypt. Oh, I love that. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> yep, that's mine. <laughs> that would be mine, what if but regional the other if the other one was What if Maine like, had starter poke? My second choice would be fire. Easily. Okay, now we have New Jersey starter Pokemon. Let's see these. Pokemon. Excited. Here is our These are very starter, cool, by the way. Paracute, the cute Pokemon. Cute. I love it. Paracute evolves into Squabby, the charming Pokemon. I like it. Squabby evolves into Quake or Sare, the Raider Pokemon. Pirate. It's a pirate. It's a pirate. I love it. Pokemon. Now here is our fire starter, Torkid, the playful Pokemon. Amazing. Torkid evolves into Agoat, the ashen Pokemon. Cute. Agoat evolves into. It. Diabres. Oh, bro, it's a sorcerer. It's a sorcerer. Oh, that's cool. By the way, make sure to go and subscribe to Pragmagic. He does like awesome content. Diabolic Pokemon. Finally, I love that. here is our water starter, Krubby. Krubby, the timid Pokemon. Oh. Krubby evolves into Huncrab, the tough Pokemon. Oh. Huncrab evolves into Abyssal. Oh a my god. Pokemon. Oh. I mean, I love it. But it's a bit concerning. Oh. 
I'd probably go with the fire starter. Fire one looks like a great guy to be around again. And he's and he's magic. This guy just looks um concerned. He doesn't look happy about what he's doing either. I mean look at the I look look at that. It's like he's sad. Hmm. I like I like these though. That's a cool idea. And like the kelp. Yeah, that's it's cool on that one. That'd probably be my second choice. What if Nevada had starter Pokemon? Let's see, shall we? I'm very excited. Here is our grass starter, Luckit, the weasel Pokemon. Luckit evolves mm. into Kleptera, the hustle Pokemon. Kleptera <laughs> evolves That's into like... Charmine, the That's mischief like Pokemon. I like that one. Now here is our fire starter, <clears throat> Smogila, the smog Pokemon. Smogila evolves into Hilava, cool the burst Pokemon. Hilava well, evolves cool. into Hilazilla, oh, the radioactive that's... Pokemon. Finally, here is that's our water cool. starter, Buggle, the diving Pokemon. Buggle evolves into Swimsect, the swim Pokemon. Oh, well, Swimsect nice. evolves oh, okay. into Swimvader. <laughs> yep, yep, that's mine. That's mine. I probably choose. I choose this one, then the grass starter. A fire starter. Wait, what was? Oh yeah, the fi actually no water fire grass. That would be what I'd choose. That is very cool though. I love that. What if Washington had starter Pokemon? Here is. I don't know. Let's let's see. This is our grass starter, Vertebrat, the climbing Pokemon. It's okay. Vertebrat evolves into Camopod, the hiding I like Pokemon. That. Camopod evolves into Stompine, the disguise Pokemon. Hmm, pretty now bland, here is our fire starter, Caffry, the gentle Pokemon. Caffry evolves cool. into Elkindle, Ooh. the antler Pokemon. Elkindle evolves into Volcanic. The oh, that is Pokemon. sick. Finally, here is our water. That is sick. Their starter, Nibub, the nibble Pokemon. Nibub evolves into Beebold, the bold Pokemon. Like Beebold evolves into Wackaster, the brave Pokemon. <laughs> like and subscribe. Yeah, I'm to totally more. going fire starter. What if there? That is had sick. Starter what if Texas had starter Pokemon? I don't know. It sounds cool. Is our grass starter Devile, the I like orange it. Pokemon. Devile evolves into Cactoad, the thorny Pokemon. Cactoad evolves a bit into mischievous. Lagarock, the rocker Pokemon. That's quite cool, actually. I like that. Now, here is our fire starter, Magmu, <clears throat> the beefy Pokemon. Magmu evolves into Beefire, the beefy Pokemon. Beefire evolves into Minostar, the sport Pokemon. <laughs> Finally, here is our water starter, Garzul, the coastal Pokemon. Garzul evolves into Azaluna, the gazing Pokemon. As a Luna evolves into Avianaut, the celestial Ooh, Pokemon. I like that. Which starter would you choose? Let I'd probably choose the water one, to be honest. That's a tough one, though, because none of those are really my favorite, but they're still good. Make sure to leave a comment down below on which one's your favorite one out of all of these. Or you can just do a list of your favorites. I don't know. What if Florida, Florida. had starter Pokemon? Let's see. Here is our grass starter, Citrodile, the citrus Pokemon. Citrodial evolves into Gagarang, the foolish Pokemon. Gagarang evolves into Croco Loco, the jester Pokemon. Huh. Now here is our fire starter, like Pestorch, the tiny Pokemon. Pestorch evolves into Smolger, the trooper Pokemon. That's very cool. Smolger evolves into Volcrown, the royal Pokemon. Yes, that is Finally, awesome. here is our water starter, Snorkaf, the sea cow Pokemon. Snorkaf evolves into Manasee, the bubbling Ooh. Pokemon. Manasee evolves into Snorcerer, Ooh. the arcane yeah, Pokemon. That's mine. <laughs> Which starter would you choose? Let me know in the comments. This, this is, is his Conera region. region. With some incredible artists for the past few months. Pretty much all of what you see in this video is done by them. They will all be credited in the description, so make sure to go check them out. So here is the Cornera region. It is based on the Four Corners area of the US which is the group of states Arizona, Colorado, New Mexico, and Utah. It is kind of a hodgepodge of all four states with Colorado as a base. Make sure I, to go you know, watch this there. video. It's got video fake or just regional variants, fossils, a new gimmick, new characters, new lore, cool. new forms. Oh my it. gosh, it's just so exciting. Sorry, I'm just so in love with this project and it really has brought out a new kind of creativity in me. I didn't even know it. And for okay. now, we will, before we get started, all of the corner, the grass starter. 
Every grass starter has one thing in common. They are based on some sort of dinosaur or extinct megafauna. So I decided to go with an animal found roaming in the Rocky Mountains who has an epic prehistoric ancestor, the elk. And without further ado, I present for your viewing pleasure, Cactus. Look at Quite him! Cute. Look at his cute little cactus antlers! Ah! So cute! So all gushing aside, <laughs> Caftus is based on the Megaloceros, or okay, the like Irish that. elk, which is an ancestor of animals like the moose, reindeer, and of course, the elk. It is based particularly on a Rocky Mountain elk calf. It also loves to cuddle, which brings me to its most distinguishing feature, its horns! They are based on the Apuntia genus of cactus, or more commonly known as the prickly pear cactus. Though the horns don't look 100% like a prickly pear cactus right now, it will show in its later stages. Definitely watch out if you plan to snuggle with Cactus. If it wasn't obvious enough, the name comes from calf, as in a baby elk, and cactus. Next, we move on to the fire starter. Fire starters have thus far been based on animals of the Chinese zodiac. With 8 out of the 12 animals taken, the only options I had left were the horse, ox, snake, or sheep. Well, there are plenty of snakes in the Four Corners region, given, you know, a lot of it is desert. I decided to go with the sheep, specifically the state animal of Colorado and the mascot of Colorado State University, the bighorn sheep, aka the ram. So here is okay. Flambabe. Cute. This design is a bit more simple, but Did we see this one across, before? a little lamb with fiery elements. Its name is based on flambe, which means has two be present. So here is Marink. Cute. Love it. This pondering little fellow is based on the American mink, a semi-aquatic mammal which can be found in the Rocky Mountains near still water. So there's kind of been a pattern going on with water starters since Gen 5 of mammal, reptile, or amphibian. Mammal, reptile, or amphibian. So I decided to keep the trend going. Its name is based on marine and mink. What is it thinking about? All three starters have contact or move-based abilities. Flambabe has flame body, Marink has storm drain, and Captus has a new ability called Prickly, which is essentially like rough skin. Break out the My Chemical Romance, it's time for the moody teenage phase. Let's evolve them. Yay! I present to you Buctus, Capragma, and Gularine. With Buctus, its horns have grown a bit bigger. This I'll, des I'll, des I'll and describe Gularine. these in words. Um. Narcissi narcissistic quite like over the top like yeah I'm gonna do this overconfident and then well what do I need to say I think I think you know grumpy with Buctus its horns have grown a bit bigger and more prickly pear like it also is based on an adult elk Buctus are very proud of their horns, and whichever one has the biggest and strongest horns is considered superior. No, not superior, su superior. Its name is based on Buck, an adult male elk, and Cactus. Duh. Next is Capragma. Its once fire-esque tail has now become a full-blown flame, and its horns have become red hot. These guys will butt heads with their friends and rivals to tell who's the strongest, much like rams do to show status. Its name is based on Caprine, the Pragma, Pragma, Pragmagic, you get it. Next up is Gularine. This grumpy looking guy has now taken on features of other mustelids, such as the Wolverine, which is also where its name comes from. Gulo is both the genus and species of the Wolverine. Its name is a mixture of Gulo, Marine, and Wolverine. So here we are at the final stages of the starters. But before I introduce them, I have to give the cliff notes of the gimmick of the region. These are known as nucleotypes. They attach to a Pokemon's DNA and have a variety of effects, which I'll explain later, but one of them is evolving Pokemon. That is an extremely shortened version. I, there will be a video coming up soon where I explain them all. One thing to note is the abilities of these final stages. They are a little OP, but I kind of just had fun with these guys and didn't put too much thought into the absolute havoc that they would cause in the actual games. Anyway, I love without that. further ado, here are the final evolutions of your starters. Meet Seraphloria, Ovisuvius, and Panthagon. I love it. I love it. It's based on this crazy natural that. phenomenon known as volcanic lightning. That is amazing. I mean, this stuff is absolutely I just, wild wow. looking. 
and I wanted that same <laughs> feeling to reflect in Ovisuvius's design. Definitely expect it to know moves like Wild Charge. Its ability to change the ability to Finally, we have Penthagon, which is one of the biggest transformations by far. As you I love that. That is like a... Very cool... Vaporeon. And I love it. I would choose that. Um, the Fire Starter. That would be my second choice. Then the Grass Starter, third. That, these are... Perfection. You can tell it is now a water dragon type, and it is based on the mythical Mishipeshu, or underwater cool. panther, of the, and excuse me if I butcher this, Anishinaabe people of the Great Lakes area. It was slash is an aquatic panther and dragon-like being who lurked in the waters of the Great Lakes. And as I said, it is based on a weapon. Its tail is based on a whip. It actually uses cool. its tail as one. It gives a whole new meaning oh, to the move tail whip. <laughs> it also has a new ability called Storm Eye, which raises special attack when hit by a water, electric, or flying type move. Its name comes from Panther, Pa'ahu, which means spring water in Hopi, and Dragon. So those are your starters in the Cornero region. Let me know what you think of them and which one you would pick in the comments down below. And once again- Well, that's it for this video. That was- this man is absolutely amazing. Big props to him. That's his channel right there. Make sure to go subscribe and give him a like. Good. <laughs> I don't know what to say. It's remember to like and comment. I guess. Oh. Ciao. Oh. Uh. You know. It's, it's <laughs> Just, just stop the